godly fucking firestorm on you. All right, one point three here. Give me a World of Warships review. This time here, we are inside of the Bogue. Um, this one's a bit different because it's carrier gameplay. What? Really? Carrier gameplay? Okay. I don't really do carriers that much. Um, I really most of the time play destroyers as you plainly know, it's like that. Battleships every now and then, but I do have the bulk and it's just my, my, my snail. My port. So, I really don't play this much because it's basically a real-time strategy game at this point here. Now, I'm actually playing with a, um, a person, Clarence. Um, 241 and he is in a Grimiachi. So basically he's in the destroyer and he's trying to cap A. Now basically my job was to sit there and you know look at the overall map thing today and see what's going on. Now I'm in my boat and I'm trying my best to well kill ships basically. I mean that's what we do. So, autopilot mode enabled. As you can plainly see, and so that I'm getting run out of spots by this little fighter plane right here. Now, unfortunately, the Bogue, and this is going to be a review. It, it it's I'm basically in a strike package. So, in a strike package, I have no fighter cover, no fighters. Okay. So, anytime that you see an enemy plane. You have to run. If you don't run, you'll get dead. Pretty pretty darn fast. So basically, as you can see here, I'm running away like a coward because I'm trying not to get my planes killed. Um, and I'm running over to where the Phoenix is because it has somewhat good AA. Okay, now the other carrier is actually finally bringing his play, planes in so I can sit here and wait around here. Again, he's getting shot at by that, and now they're engaged. So now I can actually say, okay, send my planes back to what I would presently try to do, and that was, as you can see here, I have my plane set up to go to the Omaha. So you can see my fighter group going there. Now, unfortunately, they disengaged, and I have a fighter on my back. Again, um, his planes got destroyed, so it, this is not good right here. It's under attack, but he did break off to get the one that's coming forward. And I have no idea why he just broke off, which is fine. That's great for me. Again, I am targeting the Omaha, even though it does have good AA. And look what I see here, more fighters. So here I come in an Omaha. Good strike on him. Another good strike. Now that's the problem. When it's a strike package, you're going to get murdered. All right, drop my torpedoes, but he's already avoided that. So right now I have my group returning to the ship. Another plane dead. And again, long as it's in this angle here, I can kill off his plane and get it so that my partner will not be covered. Now, hopefully I can get this last plane and good. Another plane bites the dust. Okay, so that's two planes. Wyoming. So I got my group trained on the Wyoming. And unfortunately, my partner dies from my own teammate. That's always lovely. Again, I tell my team what I'm doing. I'm going for the Wyoming. One of my planes bite the dust. 
Again, strike in. Two hits. And again, while he's repairing right now, because you can see it so that he was on fire. He's still on fire. And now you can see Self was climbing. But here I come with my strike plane. Torpedo bombers coming in. Switch to engaging enemy. Manual drop. And he's going to eat some torps. Group two, returning to ship. Look at these, a right on the button. Yes, you can turn Wyoming, but you're going to eat it. One, two, three. <laughs> nice. And of course, since he's already used this repair, and he is flooding. We're just going to stay on this wire move for a minute. Right, right now, I'm rearming. And <laughs> that wasn't good for him. He was meat. He just got his butt kicked. All right, I am moving forward. I'm trying to get make keep myself in position as close as I can possible while I'm reloading. Again, the fight is now between B and C. This is one of the things you have to do inside of a carrier. You do have to move around. Don't stay static in one spot. You stay static in one spot, you're not really helping your team getting closer to the fight when you need to. Group three, ready. Okay, my group's up. And as you can see, the main fight is over here. Now, there's only one ship left on this side here. And he's in for the pain train. He slipped the stat set. But unfortunately, another set is coming in from a different side. Will he live? Nope, he should have turned away from him and he turned into him. And well, 8-1. Now he is trying to go for the carrier. I'm sending my planes over here to assist in getting these um, this battleships off his back. So. And you'll see me in the cat, no, sorry, cat, in the chat, my apologies, where I'm actually going to tell my team I'm going for the Kaiser. Now, the accent is B clear. Again, my partner's already dead, but I will let them know while I'm going past that B is clear. Again, that's for me right in the chat right now saying I'm going to have the Kaiser, even though I left off the R, but that's okay. So... And yes, B is clear. That way I'm letting my team know what is going on. Now, I'm not going to say I'm a great pack carrier player. I'm, you know, at the beginning stages and everything else. And my, my captain is crap. Um, I think it's level 7 or 8. But it's not like your pack captain skills can give you a lot when you're a carrier. They didn't really boost up the skills a lot. So you see me coming in right now. First plane's in. One guy shot down. Now again, I like to attack from the front to make sure that he's running into the, the damage. Fortunately, there's nothing I can do. They've already killed the Dante. 
and here's a drop. One hit, but he is on fire. And as you can plainly see, he put the fire out immediately. Which is great for me. Coming in. So that fire there is going to stick. And of course, now here comes my torpedo plane. Again, that's the reason why I like to, when I attack, I attack in stages. And there's my drop. Now I use the automatic drop here. I should have used the manual one and came in from here closer, but he's in the channel here. So I know at least one of them was going to hit. And all I needed was one to hit him. Again, he's already used his repair, so. That flooding is going to last just a bit. Again, now my team is finally actually coming over now and going to cap B. So far, we are, we're already winning at this point for that, but you know, you definitely want to secure it. So the Konigsberg is going into B cap and you, he has backup with the Wyoming. The Kaiser and the other Koning is right behind. Now they don't have eyes on, on the target over here. Um, I was figuring that our other carrier would keep eyes on that section while I'm reloading, but he didn't do that. So therefore right now we have no eyes in that section. Now again, you can see me, I'm going up here and I'm gonna follow them through the slot. Yes, that puts my myself more in more danger, but I'm closer to the action. It, it makes it less time for me to have to rearm and get my planes back to where they need to be. Um, this carrier here is doing the same thing. He's actually moving right behind, um, behind me to do the same thing. He's not sitting static. All right. Now you can see their plane looked like it's coming in for the Dante. Um, sorry, for the Konigsberg. My planes will should be launching in just a second. Okay. I'm gonna speed up just a bit. Oh, this is, looks like it's gonna hurt him. He's trying to make that slide. He's trying to make that. No, he couldn't make the slide. Group two, ready for takeoff. Okay, my plane's in the air now. And here come another set of torpedo planes. Now this time here, this guy, he, his drop is just wrong. So he, he should be able to dodge these quite easily. Group two, maintaining present course. And he did take a, a big hit. But as you can see, our team is basically closing in for the win right now. My job right here is to see if I can take out another target. Now you can see the Kaiser looks like he's about to get it ramrodded. Group four, we're under attack. Oh. So he's dead, but. Good, good for me so that there was another target that was close by. Group 
coming in for my drop. Good hit there. Yes, and I was going, I was trying to wait just a second so I can make sure I can get this drop hit and make sure it counts. And I got it. Cruiser sunk. Goodbye. Group two, standing by for instructions. Okay, so group two. Well, there's a New York over here. And I did lose a plane here, but this New York is about to eat some of these torps. One, two. Oh, dismissed the third one. But as you can see, user is repair already. Our victory is in sight. So he's flooding, and made it over a hundred thousand. And that's me getting the high caliber because he's still flooding and I'm thoroughly appreciating that he's flooding. And basically for that, that's it. I mean, that's the game. Uh, you can still see he's flooding. I do have some torpedo plane coming in for me. I've been detected, so therefore I'm going to show you that real quick. Let's see if I can actually bought and do dodge myself. See the torpedoes plane coming in? Of course I turn into him. Torpedoes, dead ahead. Oh, I got hit by something. I dodged one set, unfortunately. I know not to repair. Cause I knew I was not gonna be able to dodge the second set. Thanks to the guy, it's a nice dodge. Solved, and sir. I ate one. Hold below the water line. And We're I hit the repair. Oh, and that's basically it. So that um, I won't be able to make any more damage for that. But this is my Gary carry gameplay. Um, look for the review at the end of this. I mean, like I said, the boat overall is an okay ship, but it's flighty. It's 